Joining us now, ladies and gentlemen, he goes by the name of Ludo Ludo. Ludo, Chris, how you doing, man? What's going on, my brother? One of my favorite, uh, <laughs> I'm not even just radio, like, personalities. One of my favorite people, man. How you Thank doing? Thank you, man. Hey, hey, listen, you know what? We go way, way, way back and just watching your growth. We and, do. And, and the whole nine, man, I'm just, I'm just elated to say, hey, man, that's one of my boys right there. Ludo doing his thing, and of course, uh, you've got this. Some this is interesting. Karma's world you created and uh, and produced um, basically an animated series, right? Yeah, man. And the crazy thing about this is, you said we've known each other a long time. I've been uh, creating this and doing this for over fourteen years, wow. man. And I know it, it sounds crazy, but it's the truth. I started doing this in two thousand eight, and it, it was first a website. And, you know, we had different phases that we were going through with the mm -hmm. music and right. then, you know, coming up with these animations and all these different things. And the, the testament is to just never give up, man, perseverance. Well, we finally made it. We, we got it. And now it's launching in over 191 countries simultaneously. And nice. this is just about a little girl that's trying to find her voice and change her world, change the world with her music. And I cannot wait for everybody to see this on Netflix uh, October 15th, Friday, man. Man, see, there's one thing about L Ludacris. You don't have to ask him any questions because he has a little radio background. He knows I'm going to put all my information in there and did it within the first uh, 25 seconds. You're brilliant, man. I got to say that. No, I I, I got to say, I'm what is it easier on you. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> of course, I need the help. Uh, who inspired this? What what inspired you to do this character and do this animated series? But what inspired it? My, my oldest daughter inspired it. Well, actually, all of my daughters, since it's been over 14 years. But my oldest daughter, when she was six years old, she used to come in my home studio when I was recording all these records that the world hears and say, Daddy, I want to rap. I want to rap. And I used to kick her out. But she kept coming in the studio. And one day I had to sit her down and say, you know, if you want to rap, you got to talk about what goes on in your life and your world. And obviously that was kind of narrowed down to school and learning morals and having fun. And that's where the whole its idea came from. Mm. And so we just started creating things and then, you know, loosely characters based off of her and her friends. Mm -hmm. And that's basically where it came from. You know, yeah. one of the things is, one thing I know about you is that you're very clever. And, you know, one of the things that I like when you first started your rap career, you know, an articulate rapper, we could understand every word. And, you know, maybe they had something to do with, you know, being a, a, a graduate uh, from college. <laughs> and, or maybe not. Uh, Georgia State University. But I, I, I got to say this. If people can sit up, and I know there's going to be some teachable moments in this animated series, um, is it heavy-handed in that way, or every can episode. can people like have fun and watch it and still get that message? Every episode has a message. Every episode has music. And, and when I say music, when we say we've been doing this so long, this is music that can compete on you know with what's on the top 100 Billboard chart. So nice. to me, this is extremely trend-setting. It's very innovative. And I, I feel like it, it is going to change the world. But, yeah, to answer your question, mm -hmm. man, um, that's exactly where it came from. Just all of this, the radio background, mm -hmm. the college, and all these different things. And, and yeah, man, I, I'm just, again, can you believe somebody's been working for something, on, working mm -hmm. on something for over a decade just yeah. for the whole world to see? And yeah. now we have come to that day. So I couldn't be more proud. Right. I, another quick question. Your, your daughter, you said she inspired you to do this series a long time ago. Uh, is is she a singer? Is she a rapper, a musician, or she's a combination of everything? You know, when she was early on, when she was young, she experimented with it. But right now, she's in college, man. She goes to Spelman, and um, you know, she kind of consults with everything, just because her number one job, as I've always said, is going to be is going to be school. Mm. So she was the inspiration behind it, and uh, you know, she kind of helps with a lot of decision making, and that's where we at with it now. But nah, she she her full time job definitely still school. Nice. October 15th, y'all. It's going to be on Netflix. Check it out. Um, Karma's World. I, I can't wait to watch it. Produced and, of course, executive and creative and, and the whole thing. Ludicrous. Mr. Chris Bridges. Man, you know what? You keep doing your thing and being an inspirational because here's what I like. You've come full circle, man. You've, you've done everything with your career. Now you're giving back. And this is your way of giving back. I know this, and I think I know this about you, oh and I'm I'm happy about Thank this. You. And this is your love. This is your baby of 14 years. It's going to be birthed on October 15th. I'll be watching. I want everybody to watch it on Netflix. Hit me up at Russ Parshall and let me know what you think. Uh, I'm trust me. I, I'm sure I'm going to enjoy. It. I can't wait to watch it, bro. Absolutely, and that means the world to me, man. That Thank means you, man. The world to me. So I appreciate everybody for supporting, man. It's like you said, this comes full circle since we've known each other so long. 
Yeah. Why you think I'm begging people to watch it? It's been 14 years. <laughs> yes, absolutely. You ain't got to beg, man. I'm always looking for some, like, you know, programming that we can all can relate to. So this is beautiful, man. All right, Luda. Good talking to you, brother. Thank you, my brother. All right, Love, you take care. Man. No doubt.